Hey, welcome back. Do you want to feel more energetic? Well, we're going to show you how. Today we have nutritionist, holistic nutritionist, Laura joining us. Yes, thanks Hi, for Laura. having me, Sally. Yeah, welcome. So is it true that a lot of people come to you because they, are, they don't have any energy during the day and they're just don't know what to do with it. Absolutely, you know, like a lot of people are eating the wrong things and it's actually causing them to have slumps and energy crashes throughout the day. Yeah, mm -hmm. so what are some tips that you could tell us to fix that? Yeah, so I actually have three tips to help you eat your way to more energy. Love it. So the first tip that I have is to actually cut back on sugar. So a lot of people don't like hearing this one, All but right. it's, <laughs> I know, it's not that, you know, it's not one that you really want to hear, but yes. it's, it's a very big one. Any type of sugar? Um, mostly refined sugars. Okay. So, yeah, so you really want to cut back on refined sugars, particularly sweetened drinks. So mm. things that have no fiber in them, because when you're eating sugar with fiber, the fiber is actually going to to slow down the absorption of the sugar into your bloodstream okay. so you're not going to have those highs and those lows so it's going to be a little bit different so we're going to try to avoid things that are sweetened with refined sugar so anything like pastries or like oh. i know <laughs> um coke you know like sweetened beverages mm. anything like that yeah okay so ref no refined sugar. Well, as much uh, as possible. As possible, yeah. yeah. In Do your best. Ideal world. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Anything else that we should be aware of? Yeah. So my second tip is to eat locally, eat seasonally, and eat organic. Okay. Yeah. So if you're eating locally and seasonally, the food that you're taking in is actually going to be a lot fresher than the food that comes from very far away. Mm -hmm. So the fresher the food, the more nutrient dense it's going to be, and the more energy it's going to provide your body. So. Do you go to a specific one um, in the city or? Yeah, there's a lot of really great farmer's markets in the city. Okay. So if you um, if you just look it up online, you can find one probably close to you because so there's farmers so markets. many. Yeah, farmer's markets are a great way to go. And I, I guess that's great because if you go there, then they, they'll have the seasonal stuff because I want to know what's fresh right now. Exactly. So in Canada, it's a little harder because we do have the winter. So we can't eat seasonally and locally all the time. Mm -hmm. But just do your best to eat as seasonally and locally as possible. And summertime is a great time to do that. And you said organic. Yes. So in terms of organic, studies have actually shown that organic food contains uh, more nutrients than conventional food. Mm -hmm. So if you can eat organic, do your best. Uh, do your best to uh, eat as much organic as you can, as much as you can afford at least. I know it's it's a little bit more expensive. Yeah, right? but you get more bang for your buck. So if you're getting more but it's nutrients, for you. exactly. Yeah. If you're getting more nutrients in there, it's worth the money. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what's your third tip for us? Yeah. So my third tip is to actually change your breakfast. Uh oh. So a lot of us, without even knowing it, are starting off our days on a very bad foot mm -hmm. um, in terms of energy. So the or food, not at all. Or not at all. That's that's bad too. So. Yes. Yeah, so a lot of us are eating food um, that is, again, like the sugar, spiking our blood sugar, mm -hmm. and then our blood sugar is dropping, and it's sending us into these crashes, so yeah. we're just really tired. And then you need the coffee. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, so the things that we shouldn't be starting our day off with is are things like toast, cereal, um, bagels, all those things that like we've probably grown up eating and yeah. we're used to eating. And they're so easy. Very easy, very so easy. easy. But I have a meal here that's very easy as well. Good. So one of my favorite meals that I have here. Um, it's so pretty. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so you want to eat the rainbow. You want to eat colorful. Okay. So this is a great way to do it. So for breakfast, I love to have some eggs. You have a really great source of mm, protein there. Me too. And then you want to throw in some fat. So the fat and the protein are going to uh, digest slower. Okay. Keep you fuller for longer mm -hmm. and then prevent you from having that energy crash. So would you say that's like one serving of let's say avocado? Yeah, I'd say that's that's a perfect for okay. a serving of avocado. Okay. So we've got the eggs, we've got the avocado, and we've got some complex carbohydrates mm -hmm. here in the sweet potato. So sweet potato is really, really great. You've got a lot of fiber in there as well. So adding the fat, the protein, and the fiber to your breakfast is really gonna start your and day off. And it's a natural right. sweetener. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So the fiber is what you want in the sweet potato. So and just a little bit of tomatoes just for freshness. Yeah, tomatoes are great. You know, they add Nutrient. Color, yeah, they're nutrient dense. Tomatoes are awesome as well. And then finally, Do you so, drink it with 
Yeah, so quick? you can, so I love smoothies. Yeah. Smoothies are a really great way to, so easy. to energize your day. Exactly, mm. so on the topic of easy, this is easy too. Yeah. I love easy. <laughs> so smoothies, this isn't the nicest color anymore, but I love green smoothies. It was like vibrant green at one point. Okay. Um, you, can, you can put a lot of nutrients in a smoothie. Mm. So in here we have avocado, spinach, berries, banana. I love to add some coconut milk as well. Oh, I love coconut and, milk. Yeah, it's so good, and, and you get the healthy fats from it too. Yeah, so mix all in one. You could either do the smoothie or have the brec breakfast. Yeah. Or, or do a bit of both. If you're doing a workout, honestly, I would say do both. Just yeah. because the workout I did, I needed. Yeah, both Sally deserves this. Right yeah. Now. <laughs> so I know that you have a kickstart program for people who sort of like are confused and still don't know what to do, right? Absolutely, yeah. So I just launched a program, um, and in the program, I combine nutrition, movement. You know how important movement is, yeah. and mindful wellness. And I'm really, uh, I just want people to look and feel their their best. That's so. awesome. Yeah. Laura, holistic nutritionist, thank you for all your tips. And thank you to Tyler for killing my <laughs> killing the workout today. I'm like so tired. Um, but that was great.